Hey YouTube fans, I thought you might want to see an updated doll area tour. So today I moved my dollhouse from against this bench to this wall. I thought it made my room look so much bigger. See, this is my room now. So much bigger. So, on the bottom floor of my dollhouse, I have the kitchen area which I have a vanity stool as the kitchen table. I have a couple of cats. I have Krissa and Gloria, who is j number 41. She finally has a name, yay. I have a, a little stroller with a puppy dog in it. And then I have Addie and Monique, who is number 23. This area is supposed to be kind of like a little um, living room, but I don't really have living room for furniture in there right now. Moving up, I have I have two beds. One is sort of a futon. I sewed it inspired by with an American Girl fold-out chair, but I didn't want to buy it because it was too pricey, so I made one myself. Then I have Molly in here. I've got a I've got a Target baby shoe shoe that I've got a, a really long time ago. I've got this little baby I brought back from a garage sale in Minnesota. I made her outfit. I think she's just so cute. I've got coconut. It's an older coconut from about 10 years ago. It has the magnetic mouth. This bed here is made out of a pillow. And I put the Bitty Babies uh, crib blanket thing on top of it. And one of my Bitty Babies just kind of taking a nap in the house. On this deck, I have a kitty. On this other deck, I have uh, the, I have a, uh, I can't talk, I had three cups of coffee. I have a, a pink tutu that I've had since I was eight years old. Um, I know I'm a doll hoarder. Here, uh, underneath that deck, I have the wardrobe. And inside the wardrobe is mostly just underwear, socks, and um, tights and stuff like that. On top of the wardrobe, I have some kitchen things. I got a bucket, a wine glass, and in the box, I have a little tea set. The top of my house didn't really change. I still have my easel from the, the doll school set and the music stand from the violin set. And there's Samantha and Juliana. They say happy Valentine's Day and happy President's Day. Juliana is uh, retired number four. And she looks exactly like me when I was a little kid. So, over here, I have my doll bench with Elizabeth, Felicity, and Kit. And my big purple trunk with McKenna and Ivy shoved into one bed. They're having their Valentine's uh, President's Day sleepover. I have Eleanor Rose who is number 40, and she is my just like you currently. She looks exactly like me now. We have matching glasses, and we pretty much wear matching clothes, and she has her little crutches that match my old crutches. I've got the Bitty Baby Potty. I have Charlotte here in her wheelchair. She's the doll without hair. She has medium skin and hazel eyes. Let's see if I can turn her around. Here she is. So this is what she looks like without her hat on. I did get her with a hearing aid. I have uh, all my little mini books here. And then there's some toothbrushes, a spray, a spray bottle, and one of my brushes. I've had like three to four doll brushes up at one time for some reason. I've got the doll bags under the desk. My dolls are such bag ladies. Of course, they have to be mini-me's, and they have to be just like me. Here I have some of the doll bunk beds. These are from the 90s. They were by Pleasant Company, and they are so long retired. You can probably find them on eBay, as did I. I made the bedding. I'm sorry I'm talking so fast. I, Like I said, I had three cups of coffee. I made this out of... A fa fabric from the remnant track at Joanne Fabrics. It has ballet tutus on it. I have my bitty twin Dan. 
who's the brunette twin. On top I have I have Abby and Charlie. They're blonde and the dark skinned boy. No, I'm not disgusting. I'm black and white. I'm just not prejudiced and I need more diversity in my dolls. And I, I just thought this little boy was so cute. And I thought this little girl was really cute. So I got them together. No, they don't have to be twins, but why not? Why, why not? There, there are black and white twins that happen. So, and the, I made this crochet blanket. I love it. I would love one for myself. It's so fluffy. Look at it. Don't you think that would be like the fluffiest blanket? Here I have my bitty baby crib I got for free from the neighbors. My neighbors put it out by the street so to give it away for free. So I have three bitty babies in it. I have... This is actually an Arnu baby. Who was a precursor to bitty baby. She's a little bit fatter. She's a lot chubbier than bitty baby. I got her as graduate high school graduation present. Uh, she was from eBay, because there she's not no longer sold. Here's baby Evangeline, who has medium skin, dark brown hair, and dark brown eyes. And she looks exactly like me when I was a baby. Here's Branislava, named after Branislava Nijinska, a ballet dancer. She has a knit hat, sweater, and socks on, and I made them all. So, and that is all my doll stuff. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you would like more doll videos, or knitting or crochet videos, or any music videos, I play violin and viola, please let me know. Thank you for watching.